Hey guys, it's Ash here from STG Global. Uh, today we've got one of our wonderful 13,000 litre fully galvanised water trucks and I'm going to walk you through the truck and show you why this is the best truck that you can buy on the market today. We're down here at the business end of the STG WT13000 fully galvanised water truck. And as you can see, there's more spray heads here to poke a stick at. We've got three spray heads at the top and we've got two at the bottom. And so talking about the spray heads at the bottom, we've got a couple of different options for you guys. Well, you can either have the standard option, which is a drop down uh, bar that we have here. And what that does, it gives you a really nice V pattern on the ground. The other two options that we offer is that we offer a pressurised dribble bar and also a gravity dribble bar. So the reality is we can have whatever you want, you guys have just got to let us know. Now as you can see here at the back of the tank, everything here is built to last. We've got stainless steel products and we've got fully galvanised products. It's really built tough and to be used in the harsh Australian conditions. Now we've got a, we've got a ladder, which as you can see, comes up and down. And as everyone knows, there's really limited space for hoses on a water truck. We're using every square centimetre to put as much water as we can in for you. And so what the smart engineers have done is actually managed to hide some hoses down here. And we've actually got not one, not two, but actually three metres of hose that can fit within the undercarriage of this vehicle. Now, if you're thinking about using this truck in an application to either fill up another truck or use a road stabiliser, we've thought about that too. We've got a heavy duty tow point at the back here, which can be used to clip on a road stabiliser. And we've also got a pressurised out section where you can either use it to fill up the road stabiliser, fill up another tank, or alternatively, just get the water out as quick as you can. Now, moving along is our one and a half inch fire reel. Now these things pack some serious pressure. You can use them to wash down machinery. You can use them to wash down the road. You can even use them to water the plants. We've got 20 metres of one and a half inch wash down hose on this reel, and it's more than you'll ever need. Now, as you've probably understood, we're really passionate about rust prevention and creating a product that has got a huge amount of longevity. And so we've even gone and created our water trucks and we've used a marine grade aluminium tint wiring. And what this does is ensures that the wiring doesn't get any corrosion. Now, in order to comply with mining regulations, all of our pneumatic airlines are actually in solid conduit. Now, one of the other things that we do is ensure that the air pneumatic lines are separate from the electronic lines, as you can see here. One of the other exciting features on the STG water truck is the fact that we use spray heads that have collars on them. And so what that means is you can actually change the width of the spray pattern you can go from a very narrow pattern into a very wide pattern. And all you need to do that is take off the loosening nut here on the side and turn it around to get the desired angle. Now, most of these trucks are filled up by a hydrant and all of our trucks have got certified hydrant fill points. And what I mean by certified hydrant fill points is that we have a one-way valve at the bottom and we also have a required air gap up at the top. One of the options that we recommend that you take is the Amalok 400 rust protection coating. Now the Amalok 400 is a two-pack acrylic enamel and it's specifically designed for industrial applications. Now we put that on the chassis and what that means is that you'll get a much longer life out of the chassis than you will without putting it on there. Given the hard conditions that the STG water trucks find themselves in, we found that the LED lights in terms of the tail lights the spotlights and the beacons was really the best way to go for our application. As mentioned before, this is one of our mine spec models. And as you can see here to my left, we've got a rollover protection system. Now, STG Global has actually gone and engineered our own. This is our design. We built it in-house. In and what this means is that we can get the truck to you faster. One of the unique factors of the STG water truck is the fact that we're the only manufacturer to hot dip galvanise our products. As you can see here, they're made with 6 mm 345 grade steel and they're fully hot dip galvanised after manufacturing. Now what this means is no more rust and a greater life on your water truck. 
Now what you can see up here at the top is the STG spill deflector. And what that does is stops water spraying over the top of the tank. We had instances where customers were using it in applications where they were going quite drastically downhill and the water would then spill over the tank and into the transmission and onto the cabin. And so what we did is we designed the guard at the top to ensure that the water can't do that anymore. Now on all our STG water tanks, we've got site indicators at the front right and the back left. The reason why we put it in that location is to give the driver an easy reference point to understand how much water is left within the tank. Now one of the reasons that the STG products are so strong is that whenever there's a penetration in the tank, we actually put an extra 6mm plate and weld that behind that spot. And so as you can see through here, we reinforce any spot that's potentially got any movement. And it's for those simple reasons that it makes the STG tanks the world's strongest water tanks. One of the other unique features of the STG product is all the spray heads are connected by roll grooves. And so what that means is that whenever there's a spray head and you want to change the spray pattern, you just get a 15 mil spanner, undo the nut, and then rotate the spray head to whatever spray direction you'd like to use. Given the hard environment that the STG water trucks find themselves in, we've chosen to go with a heavy industrial application for the mud guards. Now, not only are they reliable, but in the circumstances where they do get broken, they're very easy to replace. One of the ways that STG Global can accomplish such short lead times is that we've designed the tanks to be able to go on any truck chassis. And so the way that we've done that is a very unique bolt pattern that we've got here. And what that allows is it allows flexibility to put the modules on any truck chassis, whether it be Japanese, European, American, we can fit onto any truck chassis worldwide. One of the unique functions about our bolt design is that it allows us to complete the truck without needing to weld post galvanisation. And what that means is that there's no weak points in the galvanisation for any rust to start. Now the other unique part about our design is that we actually provide spaces and springs within the mounts which will allow an element of flexibility. Now you can imagine a truck going down a road in a mine site, you're going to get a fair bit of flexibility. And so what this allows, it allows the truck chassis to actually move and stops any cracks in the chassis. Now this might sound really strange, but the STG tanks are actually not designed to carry water. They're actually engineered and designed to go through the galvanising process. Now, if any of you have seen a trailer, and a galvanised trailer, what you'd notice is a distortion on the side of it. Now, what you can see here with the STG product is that we have really minimal distortion for a hot dip galvanised product. And the way that we've achieved that is that we've over-engineered the product. Now, one of those over-engineering features, we've actually got baffles all the way through the tank. We've got one about here, another one here, and the last one down here. Now let's talk about the vertical baffles. Now looking into the belly of the STG Global fully hot dip galvanised water tank, what you can see is that there's latitudinal and longitudinal baffles. This not only increases structural integrity, but also reduces water movement and also helps to increase the stability of the truck. At STG Global, we've designed some fold down handrails and, and that helps with transporting the truck where you need to put it on a low loader. And it's as simple as removing some of the bolts, lifting the handrails up and folding them down. We've got a fully certified hydrant fill point. And one of those factors is to ensuring that you've got an air gap at the top here. Now, not only do we have a sufficient air gap, but we also have a fully hot dip galvanised rock grade that ensures that no rocks are coming into the tank. After consulting with our customers, we chose to go with the superior air pneumatic system because everyone knows electrics and water just don't mix. The PDO system is easy to engage with one press of a button. A few of the options that this customer has chosen is the emergency stop options and the UHF radio. Now, as you may have noticed in the middle of the control box, there was a switch called self-fill. Now, I want to explain what that switch does. Our trucks are designed that you can actually suck water up from an external water source. So let's use an example. You're on a mine site, you're running out of water, and that there's a, there's a dam close by. And so what we've designed is a system that you can attach up from this point here, and you can put that into an external water source. 
And then what you do is that you just prime it, prime up the pump, go inside, press the self-fill button, and what that'll do is it'll actually use the pump to suck the water up from the dam and fill up your tank. Once you're done, all you need to do is close it off, take it off, turn the self-fill off, and then you're free to go back to work. Now, one of the really important parts about this feature is that you've got to keep a bit of water in the tank before you turn the self-fill on. And so what you need to do is effectively prime that hose. If you don't, you're going to get an airlock and it's not going to work for you. So always make sure that you're turning off the truck before you run out of water if you're planning to use the self-fill function. Now guys, what we have here is our standard hot shift PDO driven water pump. It's a very simple, reliable solution. Now the way that these pumps work is that you've got a PDO that comes off the transmission, goes into a shaft and goes directly into the pump. Most modern trucks are now fitted with automatic transmissions where you can lock it into gear. And this gives you the flexibility to control the flow with the variation of the RPM of the engine. Now, one of the great parts about a really simple solution is that there's limited maintenance. All you need to do to maintain these pumps is pump grease into two grease points. It's a really simple, easy, reliable solution. Thanks for watching the video on the WT13000 with MindSpec options. Give us a call on 1300 998 784 to book your demo and get an individualised quote.